So Placer Land Trust was formed in 1991 when the community really realized not only do we need to provide environmental education to the public, but we also need to preserve the land and the land base that makes Placer County so important. Well, the mission of Placer Land Trust is to work with willing landowners and conservation partners to permanently preserve natural and agricultural lands in Placer County for future generations. Placer Land Trust has preserved over 5,000 acres throughout Placer County from parks, open spaces, farms, ranches, natural lands, habitat lands, recreation lands, Placer County. It's been the fastest growing county for decades now and even in a recession that still continues. So what we're looking at here is uh, Western Placer County. This is the Bear River here, um, Auburn's down to the right and Lincoln's down to the left. And what Placer Land Trust is hoping to achieve here is some real connectivity in our land conservation. We've got the county's Hidden Falls Regional Park down here, some conservation easements. Placer Land Trust Big Hill Preserves here. We're here at Big Hill, just to the south of Bruin Ranch. And Placer Land Trust preserved this in 2007 using funds from the state of California, California Wildlife Foundation, and other organizations. And if you just look over here, you'll see Bruin Ranch. And we've got Bald Hill right over there, and another peak there, and the Sierras behind. And this is the 992 acre Garden Bar Preserve. Here's some land owned by the federal government, the Bureau of Land Management. And then tying this all together, as well as another Placer Land Trust Preserve up here, is Bruin Ranch. This is all Bruin Ranch. And if you'll notice, Bruin Ranch surrounds the Auburn Valley Country Club here. And this is where development's coming north from Auburn, coming up Highway 49, Bell Road, Lone Star. This is a really nice golf course, but in the future, if we don't preserve this, this is all gonna become developed. It's got the current zoning and entitlements. You could get 900 homes up there. And Placer Land Trust is all for 900 people having, having a great place to live, but instead of 900 people enjoying this land, we'd like to see everybody be able to enjoy it. I'm Justin Wages. I'm a land management technician for Placer Land Trust. My duties include monitoring our preserves to ensure that their conservation values are managed properly in perpetuity. The importance of preserving these properties and managing them properly come in a multitude of reasons, mainly for uh, wildlife habitat, for ecological services like clean water, clean air, but also for economic opportunities for the local community as well, you know, whether it be ranching or even some of the tours that may be let out there, as well as uh, recreational opportunities for hiking, equestrian, or even cycling. Fred Yeager, Board of Directors of Placer Land Trust, and we're out here at the Bruin Ranch property near Auburn Valley Country Club, and this was an area that was developed back in the 60s and 70s. There has been years and years continual pressure to do more development. Many proposals to add as many as 900 new houses out here. Those would occupy a good portion of the Bruin Ranch. It's just an amazing opportunity to work with the Placer Land Trust and Placer County with the Placer Legacy Program. I think it's one of the most important things that we can do for the future of our county. Five thirty in the morning. Here we are, Bruin Ranch, 2,300 acres on the Bear River. Wonderful fog cover. Saw about five deer coming in. Big buck, three-pointer. So we're gonna head out. Since 2000, the Bear River has been a focus of Placer Land Trust. We've been working with several landowners up and down the, the river here. The Bear, it's just an awesome watershed. It's the last unfragmented bit of oak woodlands in, in western Placer County. It's the last roadless area in Placer County. We're excited to work with the owner. We're going to need the support of the community as well as the state and, and federal grant programs. I'm Lloyd Harbigo and I'm the owner of Bruin Ranch here in Placer County between the Auburn Country Club and the Bear River. It's four miles long and a mile wide. Some of the local residents. Yeah. And it includes some three to four miles of land along the Bear River. We have been working with the Placer Land Trust for some time to put together an arrangement whereby this piece of property could be preserved from everybody else in the region to come and take a look at. And the tour continues. We're here at the Bear River, which is flowing out of Rollins Lake up near Colfax. Nevada County in the background, a stone's throw away. This is just raw land. Oh yeah, that's a bass. Hey folks, I'm J.D. Ritchie, a fishing guide and outdoor rider. Yeah, a little scrappy smallie. I don't think they're gonna get a whole lot bigger than that, but they're still cool. 
this is my first time down here on this uh, ruined ranch. It's, it's, as you can see, just an amazing piece of property. I, I had no idea that, that there was even anything like this left in Placer County, and uh, let alone California, really. So it really strikes me as why Placer Land Trust efforts here are so important. You just don't get a piece of property like this anymore. And it's really important to preserve it. There's so much for the public to do here. And if, if Placer Land Trust doesn't acquire this property, no one's going to see it. No one's seeing it now. And when, if they don't get it, somebody's going to buy this and it's going to be their own private ranch with houses and condos. And, and, and very few people are going to see it then as well. So for Placer Land Trust to get this piece of property, it opens it up to the public. And there's all kinds of stuff to do here. I mean, you got fishing in the river smallmouth bass, probably a few trout. You have, I think there's probably some kayaking and whitewater potential when the flows are right. You have, I, I bet, all kinds of mountain biking, uh, wildlife viewing. I mean, this place is a really special piece of property. And I think if we all get together on this one, it'd be a good thing for everybody. The Nisenau, the Maidu were here generations, generations ago, great stewards of the land. Today, we have to step up to that challenge. We have to be the stewards of the land. It's good morning, world maker. It's daytime. My name's Grayson Coney, and I'm the cultural director with the Tsayaka Maidu Indian tribe in Grouse Valley. Here at the Bruin Ranch, this is a place the Creator gave to people. If we go around the hill, we'll see the place the Creator gave to the ringtail cat and to the mountain lion, and the bobcat, and the deer, and the bear, and the elk. As working partners, the Chayaka Mayadu and the Placer Land Trust, we hope to restore some balance and bring more beautiful people back out onto this site. We're on top of Bald Rock Mountain, the high point of the property. As you can see behind me, we're right above Auburn Valley Country Club. The proximity to Auburn is about 10 minutes to the shopping center, so right close to town, but still nestled away in the middle of the wild. So another really intriguing aspect of this property is uh, there's several ponds on here that, uh, after a brief sampling, clearly uh, have <laughs> largemouth bass in them. So that would open up some pretty cool fishing opportunities for the public as well. We've got mallards. There's some, a couple swans out there. Red-winged blackbird, common moorhen. There's some marsh birds over there. This this pond system on Bruin Ranch is just fantastic for waterfowl. These ponds on Bruin Ranch have fantastic habitat, including potentially habitat for the California black rail, which is an endangered species. It's really been a lot of fun to have this property. I spend a lot of time up here on weekends riding around property. It's so beautiful. It has, you know, all of the animals you could think of from deer to pigs, turkeys, geese, ducks, whatever, whatever you want. I've even seen mountain lion up here and it's just a very calming thing to work real hard during the week and come up here and uh, look at what nature's provided and I think it's pretty clear no, nobody can provide anything as beautiful as what nature has provided. The educational opportunities are immense on this property. Bird nesting projects, increasing diversity in grasses and trees out there, bringing school children out to help them get reconnected with nature is a very important project that we can see happening out there, uh, similar to what we do on our other properties. As an avid hiker and mountain bike rider, I personally gave a gift to the Bruin Ranch Project. I believe strongly in the work that the Land Trust is doing because it allows me and my family and my friends to really enjoy the open space. I'm Carrie Thomas, Placer Land Trust's Fund Development Coordinator. Please join us. Help Placer Land Trust save Bruin Ranch so our children's children can enjoy the beauty of tumbling rivers, secluded watering holes, rolling oak woodlands, and the view from the weathered granite cliffs. We can't do this without you. Please make a charitable contribution to Placer Land Trust for our Bear River Protection Program today.